Hello and good afternoon. My name is Conrad Mihalik, and I will be discussing the critical reception for Brendan Jacobs Jenkins's play, An Octoroon. The play, originally published and produced in 2014, garnered incredibly positive reviews across the board. Not only was the original production well regarded, but every subsequent production across the years has been met with favorable reviews thanks to Jacob Jenkins's writing. The very first published review I found for this play was from 2014. Joe Jemianovich of the New York Daily News described the play incredibly positively. Albeit sparse on details and quite bite-sized, the review does mention that An Octoroon is a play that is intended to make the audience feel, and the 2014 production directed by Sarah Benson does exactly that, making the audience feel everything from humor to horror within its runtime. Another review of the Benson production of An Octoroon was written by Jesse Green of The Vulture. Green states at the very top of her review that she hated Jacob Jenkins's play Appropriate, and that it is an incredible shock to her that an Octoroon is so good and so wildly funny that it actually may have been her fault for not understanding Appropriate, rather than the playwrights or the productions. She goes on to describe the play as absolutely bombastic, a catered feast that sometimes attempts to do too much, but it's a meal that'll leave you satisfied and the one that you will not forget for quite a long time. With the play's popularity and reception both surging, 2017 saw an adaptation produced in London's Orange Theatre. Reviewed by The Guardian's Michael Billington, it garnered an incredible amount of praise not for its production or directorial team this time, but instead its actors, specifically Ken Nwasu. The particularly standout scene for Billington was Nwasu in half whiteface fighting to the death as both George and McCloskey. Billington even ends his review by stating that this play, quote, proclaims Jacobs Jenkins as an exciting new dramatist who questions what it means to be dubbed a black playwright. The following three reviews are all discussing the 2021 production of An Octoroon directed by Judith Moreland of the LA Theater. The three reviewers are Edward Hong of the Nerds of Color, Evan Henderson of the Broadway World, and Charles McNulty of the Los Angeles Times. Clearly colored and framed by both the COVID-19 pandemic as well as the Black Lives Matter movement, these reviews state that the play has not only been a tremendous and thunderous return to dramatic and comedic theater, but that the play is far more boundary-breaking than ever before. Brendan Jacobs Jenkins has written a play that has not gotten less relevant with time, but rather more, with phenomenal directors iterating on previous productions and only making the overall presentation more thought-provoking and daring as time goes on.